pap smear, they take a scrape or a nick out of the cervix. They've just damaged the cervix. If there is a problem, your body will tell you. Every time this lady comes across my FYP, she's lying about something to do with the female body. Usually it's lying about like using castor oil to cure endometriosis or something. But this, this I cannot ignore. This is a pap smear brush. And this is what it looks like. What we do with this brush is that we collect a couple cells from the cervix and send those to the pathologist to tell us if there's increased risks of cervical cancer. This is not taking scrapes out of your cervix. It is not hurting your cervix. The thing with cervical cancer is that when you're in the early stages, there are no signs and symptoms. Your body is not gonna tell you if you have microscopic cancer in your cervix. Now your body will tell you that you might have a problem when you are having heavy bleeding or you start having pain, but at that point, your cervical cancer is so advanced that the chance of surviving is lower. I wish our bodies were smart enough to just tell us when things are wrong. Sometimes they give us clues, but especially for early things, like stage one and two cervical cancer, your body may not tell you. So for this lady to tell you to basically not get a pap smear, I think is one of the worst things that you can do to women.